It's been a dream of a season for the Grand Rapids girls basketball team. Yes, they've had their ups and downs along the way, going 22-7 and so far to this point. But now the Thunderhawks are headed to state after missing out the past four years. Four years and four straight losses didn't extend to five when the Grand Rapids girls basketball team took down defending champ Princeton in the Section 7-3A final last week. It's a great feeling. You know, it hasn't really sunken in yet, but... As we're in school and everybody's saying congrats, it's like, oh man, we're actually doing this and we finally made it this year. It wasn't real, it seemed like. It was just amazing when that buzzer hit. Just ran over to your team and like it was just a big huddle and it's like, oh my God, we made it. For the Thunderhawks, that win was due in part to a new attitude the team took on over the summer. Girls made a decision this summer actually that defense had to change and that was our whole goal this year was defense, tight, close, stopping dribble drives and just a lot of more intensity than what we had. We just wanted to push ourselves to that defense. We want to shut teams down. So like we all have that mindset into that definitely. Now Grand Rapids is back at state for the first time since 2011. I think it'll be just a fun experience for us, so we'll be just excited to play. I don't think we'll be like nervous or scared in a way, but I think it'll be more of a fun, like, oh my gosh, this is so awesome. It's very rewarding to be going with this group of girls. And while the team doesn't have any previous state experience, not one person on our team has been there. They believe their youth could propel them into the tournament if they continue to play defense. It was our goal to get down to state, but I guess we have a new goal now just to get as far as we can. We need to stick to that defense that we played and we just have to stick on that bar. We need to get and stay there and play that well as we have. And we just got to stick together and play as a team. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.